أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم So my point is valid. My point stands. You are being a hypocrite when you talk about freedom to insult other people and their religions and not include the Jewish people in that. When did I ever say I don't want that. I just said two Let me finish my point. Let me finish my point. I believe, I believe anti-Semitism is evil. Did I say anything like that? It is banned, rightly so, in Britain. Likewise, the British government and the lawmakers should go a step further and ban and ban insulting of the Muslims and the Christians and the Buddhists and all other people of religion. Okay, now, the now just to respond. First and foremost, did you get my point? Yes, I understood your point. Do you agree? Uh, let me respond. Do you, do you no. agree? No, I don't okay, agree. Okay, you don't. No, I don't agree. And you put words in my mouth. You said that I said that people shouldn't be free to criticize Judaism. I have never in my life said people should be you, no, let me finish my point. Note, note the words of my friend here, criticize. When he talks about Islam, he uses the word insult. But when he you talks about Judaism and Jewish it. people, he talk, he uses the word criticize. Are you going to let me speak or are you going to... I will. This okay. is a show yeah. for the so camera. So stop performing and let me speak. Stop performing. So I said... Do you, do you want people to insult the Jewish people? Is that what you want? You're, you're, by the way, are you a Jewish? You have to are you Jewish? Stop are trying you Jewish? to dominate the conversation. By the way, are you Jewish? Yes. Stop trying you to are Jewish. I'm okay. for the camera, I'm Jewish. Now let me answer. Good. So I believe I have every right to criticize... Insult or criticize? Let me... Insult. 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 Good. Insult. You want people to insult the Jewish people? No. Religion. You do not make... Okay. Listen. When you insult... Stop. Stop. Let me speak. Okay, you speak. keep interrupting. You're very, you're very good at talking. You're not very good at listening. I'm glad no, I'm good at something. A, you're supposed to be a sheikh. They call you a sheikh. I'm not a no, sheikh. No, not not a sheikh. Let me clarify. I'm not a sheikh. I'm, not, I'm a milkshake, rather. Yeah, I agree with Steve there. Okay. For the first time in my life, I agree with Steve. Okay. I'm a milkshake. Okay. Right? So, Mr. Milkshake. I love milkshake. Uh, especially uh, so especially the, vani question. the vanilla flavor. But, but now, 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 now we've done running around, let me just make the point. Yes. If somebody believes, we call it Brit Miller, circumcision, if somebody says that's a barbaric practice and it's primitive and it shouldn't be practiced, they have every right to say that. If they say people that practice this, which my people do, they're primitive people, they have every right to exercise that freedom of speech. If, I agree. So this is, I agree. This is Judaism. That's criticism. So this is the ideal. That's criticism. If somebody, That's not insulting. If somebody wants to insult my prophets, be it Musa, Moses, Moshe, they want to insult my prophets. They should be absolutely free to do that. My prophets. Very good point. Now, now my point is, can, can, I, can, I make, can I make my point? What we initially got onto is what is freedom of speech? Freedom of speech becomes problematic when you insult violence. So if I tell everybody here to attack Steve, what because I don't like, because you're in, you're in the line of the camera, you're the star of the show. If I say we're all to attack him, that's illegal because it threatens his liberties. Okay, let me understand your point clearly. Very good point. What's your name? Joseph. Yusuf. Joseph. Yusuf. Yusuf. Yusuf has made a very good point that I believe religions can be criticized um, and people should have the, the right to do so. I agree with uh, Yusuf or Joseph. I agree with him completely that people, scholars, individuals, the masses have the right to criticize other religions and deny those religions and talk about the religions. But Yusuf, do you also believe that people have the right to insult a people because of the religion? Let me not the people. No one's talking about. This is the distinction you're not getting. So our prophets, just, our prophets, not people. No, no, no. Listen. Our prophets, not people. Living people today that are alive today. That's where it becomes problematic. Yeah. And even then, so, I so, believe so, we have. So, the right so why, to why do you draw this line between dead and alive? Why do you draw this line between dead and alive? Because, because people are people. Do okay. you agree? Can I can I insult dead the dead yes, Jewish people? Yes, you can insult dead Jewish people. No, I, I don't want to do that's that. That's fine. That's your choice. I don't want to do that. But you have but the right to do okay, that. Okay, that's called anti-Semitism in this country, and it's it's, no, it's, it's not. No, it's it is called anti-Semitism. Insulting dead it, Jews. Yes, called, yes. I, insulting, insulting the Holocaust. Let me finish. Insulting no, the Holocaust you've, victims you've is anti-Semitism. You don't know what you're talking about. You've you don't. You're doing a bad job 
representing your people. You've just changed the goalpost. Let me represent your people. I'm doing a better job. You just changed the goalpost. You said you can't insult their Jews. If someone wants to insult my grandfather who's Jewish, they're fine. They have the freedom to insult my dead grandfather. You are speaking against your people now. Because it took a lot. It took it took the Jewish people it took the Jewish people a lot of effort and struggle to to pass to pass laws against anti-semitism what are you talking uh, rightly about? so rightly so let me finish and you will understand what i mean this man who's a jewish man uh, wants camera. wants the wants the people to now okay, start look insulting look at me look at me look at look at the jew look at the jew exactly did you hear that the camera is more important than all of you bollocks to that this corner has not been there for 150 years for fucking cameras so absolute bollocks to that last thing shake hands shake hands on that as well so look at me can you believe can you believe this i'm actually agreeing with steve today can you believe this all about we've got to go down and look positive so 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 joseph Joseph is actually wrong in asserting that you Look can Joseph, insult you can insult dead Jewish people. I believe you. So I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. I like that song, by the way. I used it's to. It's haram. It's haram. It's too positive, it's too positive to me. No. <laughs> without singing, it will get without, hellfire. Without, without music, is perfectly halal. Without you music, is perfectly halal. Okay. Yeah, that song so, is never halal. Okay. Coming back to freedom of speech, <laughs> Joseph believes that it should be allowed to insult dead Jewish people. I believe no. I believe it shouldn't be allowed to insult any dead or living people. No one should be allowed to insult anyone because insults usually lead to violence. Okay, now, okay and let me finish my well, point. Shouldn't. Let me finish my point. Well, in civilized societies, in civilized, in civilized societies, which is what thankfully Britain is, people should not be allowed. And these extremists nowadays who are talking about freedom of speech and don't know what it actually, what, don't, don't know what, what it actually means. Okay. Yeah, they don't know what they're, what they're talking about. Let me explain what I mean. Can I, can I just make freedom of speech doesn't mean freedom to insult. I repeat, freedom. Okay, the little machine. Can I can I finish my point? Can I finish my point? Can I finish my point? Can I can I finish my point without being heckled? Okay, sorry. Yeah, yeah, Rashid, Rashid is fine. Coming in in a minute. Okay. Is it the advert break coming up in a second? When's the advert? Freedom of speech. Freedom of speech does not mean anti-Semitism or Islamophobia. It means to criticize religions, religious figures. You are perfectly in your right to criticize religious figures, religions, and people. No problem with that. Criticism and insult are two different things. We are for criticism. This is what's been happening throughout. Let me finish my point. Joseph, Joseph. Okay, I'm, I'm finishing very soon, Joseph. I'm finishing very soon. Okay. Finish yourself off quickly. When it comes to freedom to insult, that has never been part of civilized societies. Some extremists nowadays, some fascists, they want to bring back uncivilized ideas into civilized fascist, societies fascist. where they want to insult people and their religions which instigates violence what and we are thoroughly against Brian? such ideas how okay now, 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 now let me respond Brian, let me respond so you may have very sensitive um, feelings Clearly. you may be a snowflake you Clearly. may not like being triggered with nasty words Clearly. and that's that's you but the difficulty with what you say is somebody has to determine what is an insult and what isn't an insult. Yeah. I agree. And insults are subjective and personal. So if somebody were to say that I have a big nose or a <laughs> disgusting beard, I might find that very hurtful. Somebody else might find that very funny and enjoy the banter. You can't beard. legislate. <laughs> thank you. You can't legislate for feelings. You can't legislate the subjective opinion. I understand. What you can legislate for is violence. I understand. And this is the premise. Freedom of so, speech. So, so, no, so, you spoke for a long time. Oh, sure, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, finish. finish. No, no, no. He's, he's right. Please do finish your point. Just block this up with an advert. Let's have a Kit Kat. Freedom of speech hinges on being uncomfortable. 
that if freedom of speech needs to take us out of our comfort zone, otherwise it's not freedom of speech. It's just saying what everybody likes. And I agree. <laughs> shake my hand. I agree. No, shake his hand. He didn't say it. I agree. I agree. One hundred percent. What Joseph said there, I agree. One. I agree with it. One hundred percent. However, the details are far more interesting. If we, if we apply, for example, you give an example of uh, uh, talking about someone's nose, someone's looks. Okay, like the Nazis were doing to the Jewish people, well, they, they were drawing, nose, they were yeah. drawing pictures of the Jewish people with big noses, with, 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 with a figure of a Jewish man trying to overpower the world around the globe. Okay, these images, although can be seen as freedom of speech by some people, are extremely dangerous for societies, as we saw in Holocaust. It, those images led to the Holocaust. Okay, let me finish my point. Okay, this is why we have to draw a line. A line has to be drawn. How far can we go with our criticism? When criticism, when criticism turns into insult, when it turns into dehumanization, what? Yes, yes. I, I know these words. I can use them. Ends up in a genocide if you draw people's noses. When when you start to dehumanize people, like the Daily Mail does to the Muslims, like the news, Nazi newspapers were doing to the Jews, then then a line has to be drawn. It is no longer it is no longer freedom of speech. It is anti-Semitism. It is Islamophobia, which should be illegal, and it is illegal, rightly so. The difficulty with speakers' corner is nobody ever concedes any ground, and I will actually say there is some there is some sense and some truth to what you're saying. Thank you. And I would, but I would go further. I would, I would. I, would I agree with Joseph. First time. So no, no, second time. One of the distinctions we have to make here is the UK has a tradition, are oh, you getting this help? Uh, the, UK, the, UK, the UK has a tradition of caricaturing people. If you pick up the newspapers, it's full of politicians with hooked noses and gangly features, and it doesn't endanger any community. Good. And the point that you touched on was the endangerment of a vulnerable people. And I would agree, I think that is where there is. And I would say Islamophobia is real. Some people here will say, it's not real if there's something to be worried. No, Islamophobia is real. People have prejudices Transphobia against Muslim. Is real. Transphobia is real. Homophobia is real. It is, it is, yes. And we have to legislate to protect vulnerable yes. communities. Yes. I agree with we that. We agree. Was Charlie but what Hebdo I, going too far? Charlie, was it going too far, so, Charlie, Charlie Hebdo? No, no, not in my was opinion. And, this, and I think this is, the point that, this is the point I was going to come to. That's a good point you raised. Yeah, yeah, so, Charlie yeah, Hebdo, we're going to talk about so, that now. Yeah. Charlie Hebdo is a great example. They have a tradition of ridiculing Christianity, okay. yes. caricaturing the, the Jesus, anti-clerical. Anti they weren't murdered for that. And then my point is, religion, You're right. religion, God, prophets, they're all an idea. And what do I mean by that? They don't exist. Okay. Moses isn't stood in front of me. Muhammad isn't stood in front of you. It's all in our mind. And that we can we can use all the proofs we want to prove up. But I should be able to criticize and ridicule okay, Joseph, your idea. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. Charlie Hebdo. Charlie Hebdo. If Charlie Hebdo was to was to depict the Jewish people with big noses, with a Jewish man with a hat, what would you call it? Hanukkah or what would sorry, not Hanukkah? Yamaka. 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 Sorry. Yamaka. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. With a with a hat, with a hat, uh, with long nails, um, leaning over on the planet and trying to over the planet do you think charlie hebdo would be doing something illegal so, so first of all that's a simple okay. question okay. simple Frank question so can it, so yeah. so simple so, question so, so simple answer yeah they're not the same the simple answer is one is you're ridiculing listen, listen, yeah, listen. Yeah. you're ridiculing the people the right. jewish people okay. one is you're ridiculing jesus Something right. that exists in our imagination. Right. right. I disagree, I disagree with both. I think it's yeah. hypocritical. Yeah, yeah. I think it's hypocrisy. One you cannot do, one you can do. That's where that's what we call hypocrisy and double standards. You do it all you the can, time. You can. You do wait, it all wait, the time. Wait, wait, wait. You say Jesus <laughs> isn't the Son of God. How much wait, 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 can wait, you wait, get for Christians? Let, let, let me explain. Let me explain. I believe. I believe. I believe. If you want to have absolute freedom of speech which doesn't exist in any society on the planet it has never existed in the real world none of us the, advocate wait wait, that, wait let me finish 
absolute freedom of speech doesn't exist. It's not real. Yes. It is not real. It doesn't exist. It's, it has never existed. It doesn't exist in Britain today. You're there are things, no there are things people cannot say in Britain today. If you were to say those things, you would be arrested. Yeah. You would well, be put on trial. So, so, so we all agree that there is no absolute yeah. freedom of speech. With us. Freedom of speech must be regulated. It must be not limited, not, not by me, by not by me. I agree again with Steve. <laughs> Shake hands. Time. Not by me. I'm not the authority. So who determines how far does freedom of speech go? Let me finish. Let me finish okay. my point. Now, obviously, lawmakers in Britain and uh, uh, across the West have decided that anti-Semitism is illegal it doesn't come under freedom of speech it doesn't come likewise i believe this law should be extended to other people they should also be included and and we we must we must limit Freedom of speech in that sense. So I just want to point out uh, again, again you to emphasize the point. No, 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 you're saying I'm finishing right true. now. Last okay. sentence. Okay. I. <laughs> that's a good question. That's. <laughs> I, Judaism is a religion. Judaism is a religion. No, no. Jews are a race. No. Jews are a race. Judaism is a religion. Well, and, and you can't the, insult both. You can't insult the both. The By the way, you can't insult any of them. Can I just say? You, can, you can neither insult Judaism nor the Jews. But you, that's anti-Semitism. That's illegal you know, in Britain. It's, it's Rightly so. You can Rightly so. Judaism. Okay. You I'm saying this law should be extended to others. I'm sorry. You can insult Judaism. Otherwise, it's hypocrisy. Okay. Can I just fact check a few Thank you. things? Thank can you. I, can, I, can I just fact check a few things? You seem to say that anti-Semitism is illegal, but being racist is legal. Being racist is just as illegal as being anti-Semitic. Yes. And it deals with the people, not the idea. And this is what you, you really struggle to separate. So you, yeah, let me just finish. So you want to limit, let, let, let you want finish, to limit finish, freedom of speech? Finish, let me finish. Yes. So we agree. Everyone agrees with that. We've said from day one. Right. Inside the environment. I agree. So what is racism? Look, what, what is racism? I, 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 Primarily, I, what is it? Let me, Let's let talk me, about racism. Can, can I just finish my point instead yeah. of you dictating the debate? Yeah. Uh, oh. <laughs> so all I'm trying to make is a very simple <laughs> distinction. The simple distinction is you have people, and people can be vulnerable and can be harmed in this world, and you have ideas, religion, God. Every Muslim I know, Unreservedly, unreservedly, will say that Jesus is not the Son of God. For a Christian, that is. I, it's way. Let, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. finish. Let me finish. Let me finish. To, to deny Jesus is a God yes. is far more insulting than yes. drawing a picture of Muhammad who isn't God. No, In your opinion. And there is the problem. No, you're wrong. There is the you're wrong. Problem. And you're wrong. I, I have a question now. Is it, is it allowed in Britain to insult Judaism? Yes. No, it's not. Yes, it no, is. It's not. It's illegal. No, it's not. It's illegal. People you don't know what you're talking about. That. People criticize. Adnan, insult. Adnan, Adnan, I said insult, not Adnan. criticize. Again, let me clarify again for Joseph's what convenience. Statement? What's the difference? We law, are talking law, about statement. insulting, not yeah. criticizing. Yeah. We are for, as Muslims, cameras, let me finish. You can insult Moses Joseph. to the camera. Okay, let me finish. You Joseph, no, we don't want to do that. Wait, wait. I, as a Muslim, I am for criticizing religions. Yeah. You want to criticize Islam, do it day and night. We have no problem with that. Okay. You want to criticize Judaism? No. no. To us Muslims, no, it's not acceptable. Like it isn't in Britain today. Thankfully, thankfully and rightly so. Likewise, it should not be allowed, like it isn't allowed to insult Judaism. It should not be allowed to insult other religions. This is why we believe in freedom of speech, Sorry, which, which is regulated, which is limited, like it is in the case of anti-Semitism. Okay, law? and I am being very consistent. Joseph is not for some reason.